Hey, welcome to Tech Talk. This is Ed. Hey, today I'm going to show you several ways that you can either remove your password or set a password. And I'm going to even show you where you can remove your PIN or add a PIN to your login instead of using a password. So stick around. Let me show you really quick how to get this done. I'm going to show you really quick how to use the command prompt. And it's really simple. You don't have to leave the operating system. Now you do have to um, do a search. And in the search, you're going to type in CMD. And then once the command prompt appears, go ahead and just right click on it, run as administrator. And we need to find out what your user name is. And it's not case sensitive, but we need to find out what it is. And we're going to type in net user and then just hit enter. Now you can see over here, my user account, you'll see the username right over here. Mine is Ed. So now I'm going to type in net user and then I'm going to type Ed and I'm going to type in asterisk and I'm going to hit enter. Now, if I want to blank out the password, so say I have a password already and I want to remove it, I'm going to go ahead and hit enter and then I'm going to hit enter again. Now I have completely blanked out, removed my password. So now if you want to add a password, obviously you're just going to go back and do the same thing again. And then you're going to type whatever you want your password to be. And then you're going to hit enter and then you're going to type it again and then hit enter. And then that's it. Now, if you miss mistype it, it's going to tell you they don't match. Um, sometimes the best thing to do with that is just to start completely over and then retype it again. Or you can do this instead of doing it that way and using the asterisk, remove the asterisk and just type in your new password. And then you hit enter and there you go. Now I just set my password to I love my wife too. So let me show you how to use the system of itself if you don't feel comfortable with the command prompt. So you can come in here and you can type in account protection or you can go into the system and then look for account protection. And you're gonna come right into here and you're gonna see manage sign-in options. And this will work even if you're signed into Microsoft. So right here, you're going to see pin and you can click the drop down arrow and you can click set up pin or this will allow you to remove the pin and hit, you hit cancel um, or I'm going to hit cancel because I'm not going to add a pin, but that's the easiest way to go about adding or removing a pin. And then down here, you're going to go to password and um it's basically saying hey you, you already have a password so i'm going to click change because i want to remove the password so of course i have to have the current password you can see i put i love my wife too because you all just watched me set it and i'm going to hit next and right here i'm just going to go um i'm going to put password hint blank because i don't have a password and I'm going to hit next and I'm going to hit finish. So when I lock the screen or I reboot the computer, I no longer have the password. So let's go to the last step. Um, so we're just going to go to the control panel, type in control panel. And down here, you're going to user accounts. And I only have one user account here. So I'm going to go down here and manage another account. And I'm going to click right up here where it says my name. And over here, it's going to say, give me an option to create a password. If you already have a password, that will change to um, change password. But then you're just going to click on that, and then you can change it or add a password there. And that's pretty much it, my friends. Um, if you are having more trouble where maybe you can't log into your computer and you need more help, more assistance you can access the command prompt outside of the windows operating system so let me know if you need help with that i'll be more than happy to help you out all right please consider hitting that like button and share with your friends all right have a great day